Hi guys, happy um, Saturday. So this is um, my Tuesday morning haul yesterday. I went to the one that was by my work because um, I had some time and my boyfriend wasn't going to be home for a while. So I figured I'd stop by Tuesday morning Hobby Lobby and then, you know, grab something to eat kind of thing. And then, um, yeah. So this is real quick. Um, I picked up these Jolie Boutiques um, little globes for a crafty friend uh, for $2.19. I thought they were cute and figured might as well share some of those with her. I did find the Willow Lane flowers from Maggie Holmes. These I thought were pricey. They're $2.49 and you only get three flowers. But they are gorgeous, so I did only buy one. They did have two, and I was like, I'm not spending $5 on some flowers, so I'll get the one. And then they did have more of these Tim Holtz little um, tag presses. So I got two in the 1.25 inch, which are $1.99. And then this 0.75 inch, which is $1.49. I figured might as well get them all. They have them since, um, you know, you never know when they'll be gone. And then I did buy two of these Tim Holtz um, adjustable easels. Because I have an idea for, um, like, to do as a wedding decoration piece with these. So I, they were only $4.99. And it's funny because my store had them, the one that's by my house. Um, and they had them for the longest time. And then, of course, one weekend I was like, oh, I know what I could do with this. So I had went back there, they were gone. It's crazy. And well, they had actually moved everything too um, around. So I was like asking them, and they're like, "Oh, we don't know. You know, I guess if you don't see them, they're gone, or someone moved them." But I ha still hadn't seen them. That's been like a month ago. So when I went to the one by my work, I knew they had them when I last was there. So I was super happy that they still had them. And I figured, you know, what? I'm just gonna get both of them right now because I can always like return it, like they tell me all the time. Um, so I did find this Thicker's little adventure. I thought these colors were cool. And they kind of have like little stripes in the letters. So they're very boyish, but they were $2.19. And I did pick up this Homemade with Love treat tissue in the Halloween collection. So you get 24 pieces for $1.99. And um, I did kind of open this up. They're kind of small pieces, but I thought this would be cool to like maybe Mod Podge in my junk journal book thing, uh, mixed media book. Um, cause it's like that, like, wax, glassing, you know, tissue paper. I don't know what it is. It's kind that you can, you know, put with food and stuff. So I don't know if all of them are the different sizes or what it is. It's, you know, 24 pieces. I would think, I guess, maybe they are all different sizes. But I did pick that up. They do show ideas that they have these little treat boxes, which I have seen before. But I wouldn't know what to use them with, except unless I was sending, like, Happy Mail or something. But they do make some cute, you know colors and images from those and then I did pick up um and this here and there which I didn't realize I had already just picked this up at my last store so I'm gonna go and return this because I do not need two of these and for three dollars you know don't need that just sitting around and then the last thing I picked up from Tuesday morning um was this bright metallics DCWV cardstock sack of course, I don't need cardstock, but I just thought this was super pretty. It was $6.99. And I just bought these, like, metallic-y colored papers. Sorry. Um, it's just really pretty, and I love the fallish colors, tones to them. And I like the weight of this. It's actually thick. I, they did have a few other cardstock packs like other you know cool colors and stuff like that but the paper felt flimsy so I was like I don't want to spend seven dollars on flimsy paper I'd rather just buy those you know bezel 25 sheets of the same color paper and just you know get my collection because those are pretty thick papers so that's our, everything I picked up from Tuesday morning um real quick I did place a few orders from Jamie's not too shabby shop let me share that with you so this is the first one. She had brought back a few more of those um, rabbit hole stamps in that were sold out the first time I purchased them. So I did pick up the B. So I thought he was super cool. And then this is the new one she brought in. It is Caffeinated Cat. And I had to get this because I love cats. And this is just amazing. You know, I'm right there with cats. Um, this one was sold out the first time. Is the narwhal and she did bring in the die so I figured might as well just get that so it can just cut out the image for me make it easy peasy and then she brought in the caffeinated flamingo which I love him as well I love all the animals they're fun and then she brought this one back which I wanted it is the sassy sentiments so if you guys want to read that you guys can pause the video um, or go on to her website actually she does still have these left as of when I looked last if you guys are interested 
And then um, a few older stamps that I've been wanting um, that I figured would add to get to, you know, the $100 purchase thing was this Miss Ink. Um, this is the Funny Farm Pigs, and I just thought these pigs were adorable. I'm, like, in love with pigs right now since the ever the Ventura Fair. They had little miniature pigs, and I'm like, oh, my God, I need one. So I went on a little pig crazy of stamps, so I did get that one, as well as this Whimsy Stamps. Um, one which is called Pig Punch 2 and I just thought this one was funny in the cape and this was a little bunny this one and this one's eating donuts and I did pick up the wavy nested frames die which this could look like mud with the pig so that's why I did pick that up and then the free with 60 she has is these um, neat and tangled enamel dots which are gorgeous and then the free with 100 was the um, large rectangle shaker window from my favorite things Again, that is Jamie's Not Too Shabby Shop, and I am running time, out of time on my memory stick, so I will come back and show the rest of my haul. So if you guys have any comments or questions, 